the devil of hell's kitchen wants to see frank castle back in the mcu and he wants to see the character played by none other than the character that's already played him in whatever connection the netflix shows have to the mcu that's right john bernthal so let's talk about this people want this as well in my opinion when it comes to perfect castings for marvel for marvel characters in live action five names automatically jumped to the forefront of my forehead like they're literally dancing on there and i got like a giant forehead and anyway it's kind of like a big imax those are robert downey jr chris evans charlie cox john bernthal and to spice this video up with a little bit of hatred spider-man i'm not gonna say which one but you know which one Tom Holland. Assemble the squads, we attack at dawn! But no, seriously, John Bernthal, I don't honestly think you could get a better person, a better actor to play that character. Like, he looks, he acts, he feels like the Punisher come to life in that series, in Daredevil and his own standalone series. So recently, when speaking to Forbes, they got on the subject of the Marvel Universe, and Charlie Cox was asked about his approach to the character, the seasons, and of course, what the future holds. And he says that, you know, he's got to be careful what he says and what the future holds and all that. But when it comes to some of the characters, actors, and what he hopes, he thinks that if they're ever going to bring back the Punisher, it's got to be John Bernthal because he was perfect. Like he was that character and he's the best version of the Punisher, which I do agree with. Again, as a huge Punisher fan, I do like all the live-action versions so far. I particularly have a very soft spot for Punisher Warzone and Ray Stevenson for being just an outlandish Punisher Max grindhouse take on that character, but Bernthal is the one with the most depth, with the most exploration of the character, and he delivers a performance that's very fitting of a modern-day interpretation of that character. And typically, if you read The Punisher, and I know not a lot of people do because it's kind of hard, The Punisher is held up usually by his supporting cast because he is a one-note character. Bernthal was able to deliver a human side and a quality that was more than that. And I agree with Charlie Cox, if they ever bring The Punisher back, it needs to be John Bernthal. Like, you can recast others, but he's up there with your Robert Downey Jr. When you think of Iron Man, you think Robert Downey Jr. When you think Punisher, you think John Bernthal. Because he's perfect. Now, I know some, some angry people are going to tell me how the Tom Jane version is the one. Because he's like an FBI agent or a cop or whatever the hell he was. That's cool. Nostalgia is great. I love nostalgia. But, come on. That Punisher was iffy. It was good, but the film itself was iffy. Now, if you want Thomas Jane at peak performance, I suggest you go watch The Expanse. 